Can you talk about the importance of sacral language? If you actually look at the fathers of the church, they say that the reason a language is um, sacred is because of the fact that the languages of Greek, Latin, and Hebrew were affixed to the instrument of our salvation, which is the cross. So that's why they're actually sacred. So you have to realize that every time a demon hears the language, he sees the whole context of that language. So every time he sees it, in his mind is the connection of this thing, the relationship that it has to the cross. And so he knows immediately whenever he hears it that it's sacred. But it's kind of interesting because whenever you compel them to say something in Latin, they always switch to that pseudo form of pronunciation. And they always say, well, this is how classical Latin was actually spoken, which was derived in the last century, right? Ultimately, we don't know how it was originally pronounced. But what's interesting is that the demons consider the ecclesiastical way of pronouncing it itself sacred. They don't even want, they, so when they, if they have to say it, they use that Protestant slash modern um, form of pronouncing it, and I don't let him get away with it. So when you go to the Old Rite Liturgy, everything in the liturgy had to be sacred, it had to be holy before it could actually be used. Why? Because everything in the presence of God in heaven is holy. And the liturgy is the, is the participation in the divine liturgy in heaven in which God's presence means that everything there should be holy and sacred. This is why it's important to have Latin in the liturgy because the Latin is a sacred language. It's therefore, on an objective level, more pleasing to God than the vernacular languages. And so even though Latin wa was a vernacular language, once it's fixed to the cross and Christ's um, passion is accomplished, then it becomes sacred. And from that point on, it becomes a sacred language. And so that's one of the reasons why the church tended to use Latin, Greek, and Hebrew in the liturgies. This Language, therefore, makes the prayers that the priest offers to God actually more pleasing to God and therefore more likely for him to grant the request because it's in Latin. All things being equal, Latin prayers said in Latin are actually going to be more pleasing to God, um, all things being equal. Nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti, man. Pater noster, quies in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra. Panem nostrum quotidianum da nobis odie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, et ne nos inducas in tentationem, sed libera nos a malo. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus frutus ventris tu iesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et etora mortis nostre. Amen. Amen. Benedictio Dei Omnipotentis, Patris et Filii, et Spiritus Sancti, super vos, et maniat semper. Amen. Amen.